I'm back here again today to talk about artichoke and it is a magnificent plant and we use in fact the leaves but here is the globe, the edible globe at the top and I'll just zoom in on that and give you a lovely image of it closer up. There we go, you're familiar with that and you pick off the outer petals, steam it for about three quarters of an hour pick off the outer petals and suck the base off and the uh, st thick stems are also very tasty usually so don't throw those away but medicinally um, we use the leaves because the cynarin which comes from the latin of the plant cynara scolimus the cynarin the biochemical constituent is at its greatest in the leaf you can taste the bitter compounds in the globe and in, if you touch, if you taste even a tiny piece of this leaf, it's bitter, 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 bitter. And that's what stimulates the digestive system and the liver and all kinds of other things that are medicinally useful. And that's why we take it. It is, of course, part of our um, lemon and artichoke formula. And here we go. I'm just showing you. I've got um, some organic lemons. And... Uh, those go in with the artichoke and make our lemon and artichoke formula which is in a base of apple cider vinegar. I'm just going to go right down to the bottom of the plant and, and show you actually a young plant at the bottom which will probably by the end of the summer be just as large as this one. So these are easy to grow if you have the space but you do need space. So an old use, um, which a lot of people, particularly in Europe, still use and perhaps a lot of you will know because your grandmother used it, etc. And you will know more stories than I do, frankly. Um, it was a traditional European di digestive because it cleared the liver and produced bile, which is always healthy. Bile constipation is what causes so many problems and it's when the bile does, just doesn't move. You can see it in my garden setting here along with my other flowers, so that's why you got a glimpse of them a minute ago. But uh, it's always been used as a liver and kidney cleanser and it's therefore considered a major detoxifier and the Romans were using it for these purposes all that time ago. So, so it's a very profound digestive and will stimulate saliva and di components in, of gastric juices. It um, helps the pancreas and stabilises blood sugar levels. It is a bowel stimulator and will remove bad LDH and help remove bad cholesterol and keep good cholesterol. In other words, it stimulates bile flow in the gallbladder and in the liver itself. It detoxifies the liver and it's special in that it, it can protect the liver, so it's a liver protective. When the liver detoxifies, it, can con it often converts the toxins into an even more toxic substance initially, which wears the liver down slowly. And um, the support me mechanism that the cynarin gives um, is, is invaluable because it protects the liver in these heavy wearing processes which today are more and more wearing and tiring with all the chemicals in the atmosphere and in the environment. When, so when we take these bitters, particularly artichoke leaf, um, it's actually rejuvenating the liver and allowing it to be a better detoxifier on a daily basis. So there you have it, um, a general detoxifier, not only clearing the liver, but allowing toxins to exit via the bowel and the kidneys. So it's an overall detoxifier. So, and a little goes a long way. If I take off even a tiny piece now of this leaf, uh, my, my mouth will be literally full of saliva. And that is in our wonderful concentrate lemon and artichoke. Thank you.